if there are if there are problems going forward, um, please let me know. But um, Kenneth, thank you very much for letting me know um, that it's okay now. So fingers crossed. Okay, let's get on. Okay, so I've picked up from many study centres that there is a real challenge with um, communication. So what I wanted to share with you was some is um, is to get your feedback on the principles of communication that SIPs should perhaps consider or we can use as a kind of means to challenge ourselves and make sure that we meet the um, expectations of our study centres. So um, these communi communication principles you can see in front of you. And what I'd like to just spend a moment doing um, is I'm just checking that people can still hear. Some people can and some people can't. Um, okay. Um, I'm just going to continue for another moment to see whether or not um, it's our bandwidth or whether it's other people's. I know we've got people from around the world today. Um, Yana, you, can't, you still can't hear. How are you all struggling with this? Okay, let's, let's see if we can continue. Um, you can't hear me at all, Christine. Okay. Um, so, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the webinar and I'm going to, re I'm going to rejoin and see if it's mine. So, if you bear with me one moment, I will just pause it. Um, bear with me a moment and I will come back and rejoin in one moment. I'm just going to leave the meeting and then I'll join you again in a moment. Okay. Oh, looks like some people are finding it easy to see and other people can't. Okay, um, thank you, Greg. Um, it looks to me, and um, Greg has been brilliant at this. Um, um, that um, that it's uh, it's whether or not you're on the um, the download version or not. Perhaps Greg, you could offer some advice to the um, to the rest of the team on that one. That was great. Thank you. Right, okay, so um, I'm going to leave Greg to help me with a bit of tech, if that's all right. I'm just going to focus on, um, on this bit. Mike, thank you very much for your, your question in terms of the vote function. Um, there's just me on it today, so I'm just going to deal with the, the main uh, challenge, which is looking at the uh, communication principles. So this is the consultation um, that I wanted to spend um, this time with talking to you about. The principles that perhaps should underpin the, um, the communication strategy between SIPs and the study centres. This isn't the entire strategy, this is just about the principles that should underpin the communication element of it. So at this point, what I'd like to ask you is, do you think these are the right principles? And if you don't, perhaps you could use the chat function to tell me what you think the right principles should be, what's missing, what else do you need? I'll put these back up on the, on the um, slide deck so you can see them. Um, what do you think, in terms of the communication principles, is missing from this block of communication principles that I have shared with you already? And please, um, you know, your ideas are really important. This is, this is your collaboration. This is for us to develop something that works for you and works. Okay, thank you, Mark. Thank you, Johnny. Christine, 
Um, if you're able, Christine, to give me a bit more 